Hello everyone. In this Joomla series, in this video, I am going to share about how to create our custom module in Joomla 5. So, here if you click on this modules, um, now there are four modules in my case. I will create my own custom module by writing codes, uh, not by creating from this Joomla site I will create my custom module by writing codes so I will explain you step by step how to create this so let's go to our project folder so this is my Joomla 5 project folder to create modules uh, we have to create our custom modules in modules folder here right click and create new folder and the name of the fo module folder should start with mod that's mean modules and uh, we can give the folder name as we want uh, for this example let's give foo mod foo that's mean foo module so we created this mod foo folder and uh, this for modules uh, we have to create the basic two files one xml file and one php file so the xml file and php file names should be the same when the folder name so in this case mod foo dot xml and the next one is mod foo dot PHP here are the basic two files for module development uh, we can create other files for example index page index.html uh, we are not, not working on this uh, for the beginners uh, we will work on mod foo xml file and php file For this video, I will share about the PHP file and in the next video, I will share about this XML file. So in this PHP file, let's write, since it is PHP file, so start with PHP and we have to write the define method here define and j j e x e c for time restricted access so this code we have to write in most of the PHP files in Joomla. So I will explain about this, what it mean. So this define x e x e c. Uh, this checks if if a specific marker uh, j e x e c is defined. Uh, it check and um, if it is not defined it will time with a uh, restricted access this mean uh, it is n it has no direct access to this page uh, we have to write in this starting in every php file in joomla so it is checking to not to direct access to this file so we have to declare this very fast in our php files after that we can write other codes so in this course let's start now we can write html course hello wall as we are creating a simple module development so you know, i will test with only this test 
so in this video I share about uh, how to create the how to give the module folder name and how to give the file names and uh, to write this this code in PHP files uh, this means not to direct access to this page and uh, we can write other codes so in this video I share about this in the next video I will share about this XML file and after that you know, we will make it zip file and install and how to run I will share about step by step in other videos so for this video this all for now thank you very much for your attention